I don't even think I need an intro for this video. I do not even think I need an intro for this video. But this is the review for Luton Tower v Reading. What the hell did I just fucking watch? Sorry for my language. What the hell did I just watch? 5 nil loss at home. What the bloody hell just happened? Fault to the back. Five shots on target all game. None on target. 16 shots for Reading. Nine on target. We were supposed to, to be the home side. And we played like absolute trash. Sunday league football. How can we get positive results against Preston North End? Win against Swansea. And get a point off the team that are first in the league. How the hell did we not have a better game? We let a guy called Mieta score four goals. Four blimmin' goals. Disgrace. Absolute disgrace. I am not pleased at all. Now, Barnsley is next. And if we play like that against Barnsley, we can say goodbye to the championship. We can say goodbye to the championship because that was disgraceful. As I said, the game was Luton Town nil, Reading five. And that just makes it even worse. Okay, Barnsley lost four nil to Stoke. But what the actual hell happened? This team went downhill. This looks like a bad day at the office. But seriously, like I said, if we play like that against Barnsley on Tuesday, we are going to go downhill and we are going to go back to League One. Not pleased at all. Nothing happened. We looked like a dead football team. No wonder we were at the bottom. But what the hell? How can we get results? Like I said, how can we get results against big teams like Swansea and Leeds when we we can't even beat Reading? Now the three points are further on, and we look like a dead team. Connick didn't get involved too much. Collins missed an opportunity, the only opportunity of the game, off a of crossbar. Everything else is absolute dog crap. I am not impressed with the team today. This is the end of my Luton Town v Reading review. I'm going to be back hopefully Monday to do a preview for Barnsley because the match is Tuesday 6 p.m. And I'm hoping 6 p.m. there's a different team out there. There is a different team out there. I'm hoping there's a Jacob Butterfield out there. I'm hoping there's better centre backs that are actually prove that they can play in the Lewin team. I'm hoping there's players that can create chances. Barry came on, he didn't look like he was a normal person he would usually is. Hilton came on, okay he didn't have much chances. Collins was on, didn't do much, just one header off the crossbar. We were absolutely shambolic. I've had enough now. This is was my review for Lewin Town v Reading. I'll be back Monday evening. Well Monday to do Mullet and Town v Barnsley preview. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.